everyone. I'm Mary my gamer, and welcome to another episode of Instant Replay. Today we're checking out the cave. So you don't know what the cave is. Um, it's going to show itself. It's going to explain everything. The cave was developed by Double Fine. So the wonderful people behind Psychonauts and Psychonauts Two, um, along a few other games they made. This is one of their other games. This came out in two thousand and thirteen. So we're just gonna go straight into it. You get the general gist. There's a lot of talking, a lot of narrate, narrate, narrating in the game. So just bear with me. Obviously, if I go over the sort of audio, so I'm gonna just change the audio just a little bit because it's very loud. I'm gonna take it down to fifty-two. Uh, no. I'm assuming that's on. I don't know. So I'm going to start a new game. This will destroy your existing game. To be honest, I've not played this game in ages. So... Welcome. Don't let my sultry and mysterious voice startle you. For hundreds, nay thousands, nay, nay, nay tens of thousands of years, people have come to me in search of what they desire most. Few find what they are looking for, even fewer ever leave. Welcome to the cave. That's me, the cave. Yes, yes, I'm a talking cave. Don't laugh. It makes dating hell. Besides, I have a really interesting story to tell you this evening, so pay attention. It's a story of seven people and a glimpse into a dark place in each of their hearts. But be careful before you judge. There is a dark place in your heart as well. Someday you will find yourself descending my depths in search of what you desire. And you might not like what you find either. But enough about you. So... This is about them. The hillbilly. On this fine night, he searches for his true love, but does so desire burn too brightly in his heart. They all got their own objectives. Hmm. The knight. He is on a quest for a sword of unequaled power and prestige. So but knight, will he find it before anyone else gets hurt? Ah, the time traveler. She is here to right a wrong a million years in the making. Fortunately They've for all her, got their sort of yesterday is a new all day. Got, like, different skills and stuff like that. The scientist. She is on the cusp of a great discovery for all of humankind, and a hundred million lives hang in the balance. Oh, the adventurer. She is hot on the trail of her lost companions and unequaled ancient treasure, but not necessarily in that order. The twins. They just want to go outside and play. Like what could be twins? more innocent than that? Ah, the monk. He seeks his master so he can become the master. It's a journey filled with peace and enlightenment. And murder. <laughs> Oops, sorry. So, I'm gonna play as a knight, so what's over here? Ooh. So, usually you would have like three players, like, playing like one of each character they choose. So, let's go and do I know pretty much most of this game anyway, so... Shorty Barricades. I think you can select up to three characters at a time. So, for the hillbilly, we're gonna get rid of... I'm gonna take the twins. Because why not? So, here we go. You can save like three characters. Whee. So they all have their special abilities. And it's basically all it is is jump and move. And that is basically the crux of the game. I don't know what the twins do. 
Oh, they can sort of teleport, I guess. What does the knight do? Okay, so if you go, seriously. Yeah, it's a double fine game. It's really strange because you've got to make them. There's no actual teleportation for any of them. Um, I mean, the only, you know, it's there's no actual. I can put it. There's no actual um, way to all get all these characters. Drop the curve bar. You can. You basically can grab stuff. Oh god, stuff. Okay, so I've got to get these guys up here first. And okay, get up there and use the creepy children to pull the box. And push the box. Okay. Let's move all these characters over here. What the, 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 you break it, you buy it, just saying. I don't think that bridge has been safety tested with more than two people. Oops. Careful. If that bridge Wee. breaks, there might be no way back up. And by Wee. if, I mean when that bridge breaks. Well, I hear someone crying. <laughs> oh, 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 I hope you're not here to visit the cave because we, we, we're closed. A gruesome and horrific accident has occurred and there's no way we can open. No way. I shudder to even describe to you what has transpired. For the nightmares will forever haunt your every thought. Well, if you insist. When I came in, we had no trinkets to sell in the gift shop. <laughs> you know, there is a way I could reopen, allowing you fine adventurers Wee. to partake in the unique experience that only the cave has to offer. I just need three small trinkets to sell. Just three. Let me say that number again. Three. Take this giant novelty size key. It's cute, isn't it? Open the employee's back entrance. I'm so sure you'll we'll find some treasure to go find some the treasure for the, um, for the shop. So let's go. I don't think we can give him the crowbar. Um, let's have a look. Over here, bring the twins. It's still very, very loud. I'm gonna turn the audio down. Oh, that's weird. It wasn't showing up on the thing. There you go. Okay. <laughs> he is a funny little man, isn't he? I should probably fire him. I think he's What's dipping into here? the till. Okay. So, we got all, um, just need the twins. They can die, they're just their spirits so of we Okay, let's have a look. So there's nothing over there. Let's have a look over here. Oh they do follow you. Okay, so there's a little thing here. Let's drop the bar. Because I don't think we need it right now. Take the monk downstairs. Ooh. A broken well. So if we 
because I can't fit through there. Okay, what's down here? Okay, so that's the lever. Oh, I think I've opened the door now. Whee. Okay, so I've opened the door. Jump over the spiky lift. What's down here? Oh! Okay. So there's a spike key monster there. So let's have a look. Ooh. Empty fuse box. Oh, the crowbar would be useful right here, but I think I've dropped the crowbar somewhere. Okay, let's have a look. Let's go upstairs. Take the crowbar with me down the stairs. Okay. So that's not much good. Okay. Empty fuse box, dog cut, dog machine. Woohoo! I think his is like a safe landing that so you can't be killed from falls. So if I was to jump a very high height. Ooh! Ooh! The peasant boy! So it's a knight, peasant pulling parsnips, pulling lots of things, and a knight having some sort of heart attack. Okay. What's up here? Ooh! Well, I'll take that. Okay. Uh, uh, there's no dying in the cave. At least not this soon. So, if I so much the left crank, for them to learn. So I can't use the electric thing because it kills me. So I need to use the crank for... Oh, for the other thing! Ooh! That nearly could have killed me. Okay, so we would use this. Let's go right over here. So there's a special monk thing down here. Jump, magic monk. Oop, that's the wrong way. Okay. Ooh. So this is the monk's back, sorry. So we got an old man and hang the avatar. Oh, I must have done some of these already, so the Young Apprentice. Yeah, so I've got Ang the Avatar. So, I've got some water. I have no idea what to use the water, the bucket for. Well, no, I haven't got the water, I've got the bucket for water. <laughs> Look how he climbs. Okay, so... Do I use the water on this? I don't know. Let's have a look. So I've got a bucket. There's a way to use the bucket on this stuff. Okay, let's have a look. Jump over the magic thing. Do I use the bucket on the on the thing? Whoop. I'll jump over here. Whoop. Uh, I can't. Oh! You put the bucket on the thing and then you get the thing. 
Okay, so we've now got the fuse. I'm just using the monk for everything at this point. I've not even used the twins. I don't even know where the twins are. Oh, they're there. <laughs> so we put fuse. No, I want... I want the hot dog. So, what we're gonna do... Is put said hot dog on that said spike, and then what we're going to do is we're going to take the twins while they're there, take twins, and then while we go up here, the monk can pull the lever, the the the, the bell, summon the monster. Okay, so the monk's down there. Oh, I got the fuse box. Oh, bollocks. I'm such a doof. Okay, so I need to get the fuse box to the thing. Okay. I know what to do now. I've solved the puzzle. I'm a genius. Although I didn't figure it out until later on, so maybe not so much of a genius. Let's have a look. So we then put said fuse. Uh, is that thing still munching? No. So we have to go and get another sausage. Okay. So I'll get another sausage. Oh! Bollocks. Okay, so take fuse, get sausage. Okay. I'm an idiot. I know. Okay. Now we take the monk. And we take the sausage. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put the electric box in there first. That way... Ooh. That way the machine works. And the twins can push said button. To... Ooh. Then they can press the button, trap the monster, and it's all good. So, okay, so the monk can now take said hot dog, put it on said spike, summon the monster, and then we can trap the monster. Then we can go past here. Oh. Another painting. Cute kids and happy family. Well, not so cute after all. So I've got some of these paintings already. So we've got a happy family with the evil twin kids. The demon kids. Uh, we've got the demon kids tripping up dad with a light bulb in his hand. Uh, that didn't work out as quite as planned. They get towed off and that's it. That's... Oh. So is there any presents? Is there a way to use some of the items that I've found already to So if I take the grog Oh, maybe not. Take, say, Grog. Whee! Whee! And we'll take the knight. Take him over here. Jump over the monster's pit. 
poor creature. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to jump and dive bomb. Whee! Boom. Okay. So there's some stuff that I need here. We have some dynamite, so we need to blow the cave. Okay, so I have dynamite. I just don't know how to use said dynamite. Okay, so I can't use the dynamite because the dynamite is useless. Okay. Oh, okay. I don't know what to do. Oh, if I take this to this. Boom! I could have easily killed myself there with a stick of dynamite in my hand. Okay, take the twins. I'm gonna go jump up here, and then I'm gonna jump up here, and then I'm gonna go across here into another pit. Okay. Uh, where's the monk? Ooh. Uh, don't mind me, I'm just taking that, it's fine. Okay, so the monk now has one of the award, one of the awards. Oh, I think the scientist or the time traveler can use. Or can the evil twin girls use it? Evil twin girls, the twins. Can, can I use this? It worked. Oh, okay, that caused the elevator. Oh, another trophy. So, they will take the jeweled. Okay. Okay, so, where's the knife? So, what's down here? Swimming, swimming, swimming. Ooh. A cursed guitar. <laughs> Take said cursed guitar. I've called the elevator, so I've got my free gifts. Ooh. I can't jump up there because I'm not jumpy enough. Okay. Okay, so what we need to do now is to get everybody over here. Oh. There we go. So, call the elevator. Oh, oh, we died because we were too close to the elevator. And now the elevator goes back up. Ta-da! And now we are back to the beginning. Now we have to climb all the way up to the top. Okay. And... What we'll do is we'll also get all three of them at the top, and then we'll get access to the cave itself. Okay, so let's go. Come on, monk, come on. There we go. Uh, just for the record, I am using a 360 controller, not my new keyboard. 
I have a mechanical keyboard now, which has a faulty S button. Um, but yeah, it's a pretty cool keyboard. Okay, let's have a look. And we'll travel up here with the evil twins of doom. And we'll go up here. And we'll take the evil twins to the employee player. Well, that's one trinket. A far cry from three trinkets. Ah! Trinket numero two. Uh -huh. Maybe I didn't pay. Ah! The third glorious trinket. I have to say, you have surprised me. I figured you'd give up after one. Oh, right. Now we're actually Sorry. in the cave. <laughs> well, that was a close one. It does bode well for our intrepid spelunkers that they navigated that maze of intrigue. I have high hopes for this group, much better than the last. I think they may still be down here. I should probably get them out. Nothing scares away the tourists like a rotting corpse. And we'll take the monk. So the narrator is, if you've not worked out, is the cave itself. Ooh. So, this is one of the worst paintings. Okay, so, the knight has a heart attack and the peasant steals the armor. Okay. So, he pretends to be something he's not. Okay, and where's the knight? Okay. And then we go to the Okay, so we'll move this here. We'll take our evil twins. Take our knight. I don't know if we really needed that, but... Oh yeah, we do need it, it's just a pain in the butt. Come on, monk, get out of the way! So they need to land on this to, to survive. There we go. There we go. So I need all three to activate magical button. Okay. Yeah, so you can't do this on your own. You can't do this with one plot one one um with one um character. You have to use all three. There we are. And now we are at the cave! Whoa! Some say chivalry is a trait that cannot be learned. It is a quality you are born with. That may or may not be true, but what is true is you can't steal it. It's a lesson our brave knight friend is about to learn, or a lesson we hope he is about to learn before anyone else gets hurt, or maimed, or killed, or eaten alive. Forget I said so, eaten alive. Yeah, that's pretty much Spoilers. what the cave is. It's a set of series of puzzles. You've got to work out what you got to do. Switch between your characters. You'll come across characters. Throughout the journey, you'll encounter the, the main stories for each of the characters, depending on who you've taken with you. Um, for this first one, it's the night, but I'm not going to go into it because I'm coming to the end of my time limit, or time length for this video. So please like, comment, subscribe, all that nonsense and all that BS. Um, if you want to see more videos on the instant replay stuff, please feel free to uh, let me know. Uh, I have a couple in the works, um, not decided what I'm doing yet, but I've got a couple of ideas of what next instant replay I want to do. 
and then we'll just go from there. So thank you for joining me on this video of The Cave. And until our next video, I will see you later. Fairly well.